Hey, what is going on, guys? This is the SS Ultimate Goku back into the video. Um, just a quick video. Um, I'm kind of uh really surprised that I have to be reporting this because uh, it just kind of came up bluntly. But um, I thought this was a joke, but it was on AEW's official Twitter X account. Um, CM Punk has been effectively fired from the company, it seems. Um, I, I'm, I'm trying to read through it all right now. Uh, I, I think this is a stupid decision, obviously. Um, but I like, what is this? The day of collision. And then also the, um, the day before the pay-per-view day before the pay-per-view like that. Like, they say, like, oh, look, like I'm reading it right now. I'm reading it right now. It says, AEW has terminated wrestler and employee agreement between Philip Brooks, CM Punk, and AEW will uh, cause effective immediately. Trans, uh, the termination was confirmed by Tony Khan. CEO, general manager, and head of uh, uh, creative of AEW. The termination followed a week-long internal investigation of an incident occurred backstage at AEW All in London Sunday. Following the incident, AEW distantly met, met and later uh, console with outside legal console before making the unanimous uh, recommendation to Khan that CM Punk be terminated with cause. Khan offered up the following statement. Phil played an important role with AEW, and I thank him for his contributions. The trans, uh, termination of AEW contacts with Cause is ultimately my decision and mine alone. Of course, I wish I didn't have to share any share this news, which may come as a disappointment to many of our fans. Nonetheless, I made making the decision for the best interest of many amazing people who make AEW uh, possible every week. Our talent staff venue operator and many of the others who effectively are unsung but essentially to bring our fans a great show on television and at arenas and stadiums throughout the world that's the end of the quote um this is a ridiculous decision i i don't know like first of all why wasn't this like see and this is the thing tony khan uh he said like he terminated him did he terminate him today or was it beforehand? Because obviously he made the decision before that. Because Wednesday, Wednesday he did the uh what was it? Or no, it was Thursday. Thursday he did the uh the special meeting or whatever, which he didn't comment on CM Punk. He could have said it right then and there and he didn't. Um not to mention again, the reports we got that was Jack Perry who got in Punk's face and went into business for himself and nothing happened about that. Not to mention they continued promoting him on advertisements all week despite the termination. Like, I, I don't even know what to get on. I'm like, I'm shocked by this. Uh, the real world's championship thing, which could also indicate why Dennis Rodman was there. I don't know what this means for Punk if he's done. Like, some people are already trolling that he's going to WWE. Not exactly sure that's going to happen. Uh, I'm, I don't know exactly the status of his contract in terms of how or what's left on it. Um, and uh, I don't know. This is really this really sucks. Uh, I, I'm really upset. Um, you know, and, and this also isn't going to solve the problem because the elite are still like doing their thing, obviously. And, uh, what they did to punk last year and now what the elite did or not elite, did, uh, Jack Perry did last week or last, uh, week and all, all, all in with the whole going into business for himself thing. Uh, it was the wrong decision, um, to make in my opinion. I don't really know what else to say because I don't know any of the details other than what we have been told. Tony Khan should have came out and said it on Thursday if this was his decision uh, because everything that was indicated to um, what we had heard from 
you know, the days leading up is that Punk would probably be at the pay-per-view, uh, especially the way they were teasing everything. Uh, but now it doesn't seem like that's going to happen unless this is somehow kayfabe, uh, which I don't think it is because they actually put out the statement uh, about him not being there. I mean, he retained the title too. He retained the real world championship title that he never lost. Uh, the, the real world championship, the title he never lost, and then he came back with, and he still never lost, by the way, um, is still there. No, I have no idea. I, I do not know, like, if he's, no, because, like, if they fired him, like, why would he come back? Like, I mean, there's already heat going on, so... No, I think this is a stupid decision. I, I Like I said, I don't know what else to talk about other than what has been reported. And uh, it's a shock. It's going through right through social media now. Everyone's talking about it now. Um... Yeah, I, I don't know what else to do. Um, say, is he going back to WWE? Is he going somewhere else? I don't know. Uh, it's sad um, that, you know, the journalists and all the other people that fucking bullshitted this story up um, has uh, basically, you know... Uh, and again, I, I still don't see... <laughs> or fucking, what's it called? Uh, Tony Khan, you know, did it, you know, still the wrong way cuz he could have like if this was if this was the way he was going to go then he should have said it at the fucking meeting that he just called last Thursday or just this past Thursday instead he waited until the day of collision to announce it a couple hours before the show goes on by the way um so yeah very shocking shocking I'm on team punk all the way uh very very upsetting uh to see it go down this way especially you know because warner brothers discovery said he, they liked them too so there's another thing as well uh i know people in chicago are going to be pissed off like people that are going to be on the tickets they're not going to be fucking happy about it oh yeah big pay-per-view with no fucking punk that's going to be fucking rough um so yeah that's it comment rate uh, subscribe, all that stuff. We'll uh, try to keep up with this developing story as much as I can. I'm the SS Ultimate Goku, I'm out of here. CM Punk, you're still the best in the world. We're going to miss you. Um, and uh, I hope we see you. I don't know if you're going to move back to WWE. I, I don't think so, since you waited seven years to do that. Um, maybe you will now, since apparently you made amends before you came back to AEW. I hope you do, man. Whatever you do, uh, I really hope to see you down the road. Um, I'm out. I'm the S. Ultimate Goku. I'm out of it. Peace.